There are many lines drawn on many maps in the world. Some lines match visible barriers between lands. Other lines are lines in the sand that are pure human invention. There are many lines drawn between peoples in the world. Sometimes we use the power of religious belief and cultural conflict to highlight the differences and strengthen walls. Last night's story on the 10th plague killing the firstborn of Egypt while sparing the Israelites is but one example. These lines between people are also human inventions, but that does not make them any less real in human experience. After all, money and calendars are also human inventions. For that matter, so too are religion and culture. Rosh Hashanah is not a cosmic observance. It is a human one, projecting our order onto the world. In Yehuda Amichai's poem, Jerusalem, written before 1967, when the old city of Jerusalem was held by the Kingdom of Jordan, Amichai contemplates a common humanity to be found across a hostile border and the human costs of the human conflict. I will read this poem alternately in Hebrew and in English. Al gag ba'ir ha'atika kevisa mu'eret ba'or acharon shel yom. On a roof in the old city, laundry hanging in the late afternoon sunlight. Saldin lavan shel oyevet, magevet shel oyev, lenagev ba et ze'at apo, the white sheet of a woman who is my enemy the towel of a man who is my enemy, to wipe off the sweat of his brow. In the sky of the old city, a kite. At the other end of the string, a child I cannot see because of the wall. We have put up many flags. They have put up many flags. To make us think that they are happy. To make them think that we are happy.